everybody, Black Ninja 797 here, and welcome back to another video. And today's video, I am playing Camp Blood, a custom map in Black Ops 3 Zombies. Camp Blood is a map that takes place in the Friday the 13th series with Jason Voorhees. We are going to be going around at the campsite, trying to survive, getting all the perks, getting all the guns, and who knows, maybe we might have a Jason Voorhees boss in the map somewhere. If you guys have been enjoying today's video, please make sure to drop a like and comment down below what I should do next for Call of Duty Zombies. But yeah, guys, I hope you end up enjoying seeing another custom map here in Black Ops 3. And here we are, Camp Blood. Very, very creepy setting. Uh, the box is right here immediately. That's definitely a good thing. Assuming that down here is like what the Bible ending. Yeah, 30,000 to escape on the boat. So we know what we're working with. Ooh, these are some creepy ass looking zombies. Oh, you guys like skinwalkers. Oh yeah, by the way, just to let you guys also know, uh, this map is also got Black Ops 1 weapons and is Black Ops 1 themed. The so pack is there. Double tap is here. I would like to believe the map isn't that big. Okay, let's get our first box gun, shall we? Come on, please. That's not what I wanted. And we'll make it work. And by that, I mean not using it all. So guys, let me ask you this. When it comes to Black Ops 3 custom zombies, what are some good maps in your opinion that I should play? I used to play a lot of these back in the day. And I really want to try to find some good ones again. Because the last one that I remember playing that was really solid in my opinion was Nightmare. And I heard that's getting a sequel. So maybe perhaps I can play Nightmare. That would be a really cool map to play. Now see, custom maps I feel like view-wise. And, and I know that not everyone cares about views. But like I'm just trying to make an entertaining video for you guys. And I assume if it like, gets no views that you guys just don't watch it. Let me know what is a map that would sound catchy to you. Like what sounds interesting. I'd like to hope that this map would be kind of cool. With the spooky, scary, you know, uh, Halloween vibes around it. I think that actually happened in the last map I played. Was, wasn't the last map I played like the back rooms or something? Although that was two videos ago. Yeah, I remember that was that one particular running zombie that scared the absolute crap out of me. Is this a camera? Or is that just a part of the map glitching? Ah! D Jesus Christ, that scared the shit out of me. Please give me a good gun. I know Black Ops 1 guns are hit and miss, but... <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. I got the M20... <laughs> I, got, I got the M72 law, are you serious? Okay, a stakeout. This is at least a usable. Now, guys, this question I'm about to ask you doesn't necessarily 100% tie into what I'm doing here for the video, but it allows me to be able to get some input for you guys that will affect my future videos. So for those of you guys that don't know, I will give you the summary. Basically, long story short, I am building a brand new gaming computer. This computer that I'm playing on currently for the video is my first ever computer. Now, this is old and outdated, and I need to get a new one. I have these following parts right here that I have to create my new PC. The problem is, is that the motherboard that I originally got uh, was defective. And the problem was is that I mostly am assuming is that it was rejecting my CPU. The CPU I'm trying to use is a Ryzen 9. Now, the thing is, is that the older motherboard needed to have an updated BIOS, but even despite updating the BIOS, it just still didn't take the CPU. Now, I don't want to compromise and get a weaker CPU because that's, you know, defeating the whole purpose of me upgrading my computer in the first place. I want to get a really cool computer. Does anybody know what is a good motherboard that will immediately either accept this CPU or is something that is not prone to having issues with accepting a BIOS update? Because if I have to update the BIOS, I will. I've already got a new motherboard on the way, but the thing is I really just don't want to have to go through trying to have this hardware failure twice. If anybody is a you know, a, a nerdy person like me and knows a lot about computers, please help me out because I'm more of a software guy and not a hardware guy. This is still new to me. I'm more of a console gamer at heart. Please, good gun. Any good gun would be nice, even if it's a decent gun. Okay, Commando, I can make this work. Okay, let's also open up this door and see what happens. So, we immediately got Pack-A-Punch. We still need to turn on the power. Is this all this leads to is just Pack? But, uh... I never looked to see if, like, there's a boss zombie on here. I really hope we get, like, a Jason Voorhees boss. That would be really, really cool. Oh, here's the power switch. It was actually in plain sight the entire time. Okay, so probably what we'll do then is that we'll just buy all the perks, and we'll try to, like, pack a punch, like, a gun or two, and then we'll just save them for the Bible ending. That, that way the video is at least around a few minutes long. Now, since these are Black Ops 1 weapons, I don't know what extent it's going to be in the box. It could be anywhere from a ray gun to a thunder gun, or the guy could make it where I could just get nothing but just basic guns. Which, if that's the case, I'm really hoping for like an RPK or a Galil. Any other decent gun to replace the stakeout with, please. 
I'm okay, a python will work. I'll keep it for a few rounds, but I am going to switch this out eventually. See, even though I know that this is uh, themed after Friday the 13th, this also reminds me of that Quarry Horror game that came out like a year or two ago. I actually watched a walkthrough of it from FaZe Jev specifically, because he's like one of my favorite YouTubers. And that story was very hit and miss for me. It's from the guys that made Until Dawn, and I liked Until Dawn. The problem was, though, with the quarry for me is that there was just some characters and story and plots that were just insufferable to get through. Like, I don't re even remember what the one girl's name was, but there's, like, if I find the picture on screen, I'll share it with you. This character, this girl, the most insufferable character I have seen from a game in, like, a fat minute. She was annoying to watch. Like, I totally wish that she was actually killed during Jeff's playthrough. <laughs> Only four perks on this map. Because other than the basic four, I don't see any other ones so far. I literally think it was just the pack. And then maybe there's like something else I'm missing here. But like, I think it was just buying pack. Well, the one thing is though, is I don't want to quite be back here. Okay, let's pack a bunch of the commando. I ideally want to get one more better gun. Okay, asking you shall receive. I finally got a good gun. I got the RPK. So the Commando and the RPK is what I'm going to rock with for this video. The uh, the RPK, until it's packed though, is actually going to be my main gun because it will give me more points since I packed the Commando. But when I eventually pack the RPK, which for some reason is shooting ungodly fast, like Jesus Christ. Um, but I am going to just uh, leave with the RPK until it's packed because right now the Commando is technically stronger and it's not going to be weaker again until this is packed. Well, see, at this point, all I just really need to do now is just camp on the dock. See, these are the, the hard things with custom maps. It's just sometimes is that they're just a bit too easy. So, speaking of things, in order to keep up the commentary, let me ask you guys this. Because I know that you guys are Spider-Man fans here on the channel. Was anybody able to successfully pick up those Spider-Man 2 PS5 faceplates? I tried so hard to get those. But I, I swear that I just got screwed by scalpers. Like, I swear, this was also the same problem uh, three years ago when the PS5 just came out in general. Like, it seems like for the last couple of years, any online-only pre-order uh, electronic is just impossible to find. They make a, such a small-ass quantity of these things... They're basically asking for a scalper to basically pirate these things. It, it just makes it impossible to get anything cool. But anyway, mild rant over. If you guys got lucky, though... I salute you. So one of the things that I'm working on is my next uh, COD Zombies ranking video. I'm going to be ideally trying to rank the maps next. This would be from World at War to Cold War. The thing is, is that before I rank these maps, I want to replace some of the ones that I'm the least familiar with. So I want to go back and play the Black Ops 4's DLC maps, because I only played them ever once. And then I also went back and I played Call of the Dead on Black Ops 1 because that was like the one map I like never got around to and Tagger Totem doesn't count. So I've replayed so far uh, Dead of the Night and Call of the Dead. I still yet to replay uh, Ancient Evil, Alpha Omega, and Tagger Totem. Once I end up playing those last three maps and like experiencing all that the map has to offer, like the Pack a Punch and then the Wonder Weapon of Choice and then just trying to get like a decently high round just experiencing the map, then and only then will I rank the, uh, the map. This is where Turn is working out my advantage. I'm really hoping that I can get a max ammo here. In 10 game. That's not max ammo. That's max ammo. Come on, and that's our 30,000. But yeah, guys, I hope you have enjoying seeing another YouTube video for the most unique YouTubers are ever going to see. Thanks for watching, guys. I love all of you, and peace out. Hey, meme lords. Jesus here. And you better have enjoyed that video there by the eternal god Daddy Ninja. You should probably subscribe, too. Or the mighty Moab will come for your balls. If you enjoyed the video, you might like it, too. And give me the memes. Flash, bang, boom!